Hi everyone and welcome. So it is day 28 in the EPIC program and today it is the posterior chain. We're going to focus on everything in the back. The calves, the hamstrings, glutes and back. A lot of core as well today. The timer is going to be on 45 seconds of work, 15 second rest throughout. For today's workout you will need a chair as you can see here I'm doing Bulgarian lunges. Also a mat and a pair of dumbbells. The dumbbells I'm using today for your reference 12.5 kg and 12.5 kg. We will primarily be doing compound movements and we'll be doing three variations of each. For example, a sumo squat full range, then a sumo squat one and a half reps. Following that, sumo squat with five pulses. Once we complete an exercise of its three variations, we then move on to our staple exercise, which is going to be the Romanian deadlift today. I have chosen this exercise primarily because it so focuses on the hamstrings, back, glutes as well. It is one of my favorite exercises. Today we will be doing full range, also one and a half reps, and also five pulses of the Romanian deadlift. So for example, every time you do three variations of a certain exercise, we will go into the Romanian deadlift three variations. That again is the full range, one and a half reps, and five pulse reps. As you get fatigued, of course, your grip and forearms will be affected. You can drop to the one dumbbell during these Romanian deadlifts. Also, body weight only, if you prefer. Remember, as always, don't reach for the floor. Let yourself come down only to where you feel that stretch in the hamstrings and come back up. We'll be doing a movement today called a dead stop row. As you can see here, you're pretty low to the floor. Ideally, trying to be parallel with the floor. So your back is as low to the floor parallel as possible. However, it must remain flat. Some of the exercises require two dumbbells, others one dumbbell, and a couple are body weight only. If you see me dropping from two dumbbells to one, depending on the weight that you have at home, you may wish to carry on with the two dumbbells. It just depends on what weight you have access to. And remember, the timer is only a guide. Don't rush into any position. Take your time. If it takes you five seconds to get into position, take those five seconds. It's not a race, it's not a rush. This should be at a slow, controlled pace throughout. Please ensure you spend at least five minutes warming up prior to beginning. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of these workouts. Also, any community posts that are upcoming. Remember, make this your own workout. Stop as and when you need it. Drop to one dumbbell instead of two as and when you need it. And yeah, I think that's it. I hope you really enjoy it. Let's go.
told you I'm not yours anymore. No, I'm not yours. So why are you trying to hold on? To hold on when I'm not there for you. Wanna take a different lane? Wanna play my own game? And I don't need you here. So won't you let me go? Wanna take this ball and chain that you have put on me and throw it out the window? I think that you should let go. Cause you know this is not.
from a different star Flying over streets and our broken hearts But they can even touch us, we found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead